happy vlogmas day six been having the best cozy content morning just doing my doing well daily and just planning and posting today's video going to watch episode three of the undoing because me and Delaney are obsessed so here we go gotta light the candle so my secret Santa gift just got dropped off my friend Katie ended up having me so sweet she got me the most awesome things I have been wanting one of these for so long you guys it's an electronic um, wine opener so you just literally put it on top of the wine bottle and it like undoes the cork and everything which is so exciting I've always wanted one of these and then I just never I don't know it was just one of those things I never got so I'm really excited I just come on that she got me a cheese guillotine as they call it um, so that's really cool you just pop the cheese on this little board and guillotines it just cuts it i'm very very excited about that i have a bagel guillotine at home and then she got me this beautiful mug so cute i love this one i can fit like a big old cup of joe in this so thank you katie all right time to do some dishes and clean up the kitchen Vlogmas a donation time if you guys didn't know I'm donating every day of vlogmas to a different charity organization that's special to me or special to you guys a lot of you guys have been DMing me sharing yours with me so I'm adding them to the list for sure I've donated to Camp Kesem the Liberation Foundation and Children's Miracle Network at UGA so today is another one that's really close to me and specific and that is make a wish in specific UGA wish makers on campus because I want to give back to the UGA community and I think what make a wish does is so awesome if you guys didn't know last july i actually got the opportunity to grant a wish it was the most wild email to get um a young girl named sam wanted like her wish was to hang out with me and shop and go to brunch and come down to florida so they flew her down to florida you guys the whole nine yards we drove in a limo the whole day we went to oxford exchange which is like my favorite brunch place ever because she really wanted to experience it she got to bring her sister as well and it was seriously the best day and we had so much fun we went shopping the whole nine yards I'll actually show you guys in a second like a little clip of our day you guys can actually go watch the vlog yourself it's called granting a make-a-wish spending a day spending the day with Sam um, so this is kind of a little bit about it I'm about to meet Sam <laughs> It was seriously the best day, you guys. It was the most special moment actually ever. And we just had the best day. We got to literally ride in a limo, you guys. It was so much fun. What they do is so awesome. Anyways, it was such an amazing experience. And I just think the idea of what Make-A-Wish does is the sweetest thing ever and I want to donate towards making other people's wishes come true. They do so many amazing things. You guys have probably heard of them already, but I want to donate towards UGA's chapter in specific just to help them grant wishes because it seriously makes these kids day and it definitely made my day getting to spend the day with her. So we're going to donate now to UGA's Make-A-Wish chapter. I will have it linked down below as well if you guys want to donate or if this inspires you in any sort of way. All right, it's done. Yay. This part of the vlog makes me so happy every day. 
I'll have the link down below for you guys if you want. <laughs> Alrighty, so that was fun. Now I have so much work to do today. Um, it's approaching finals week. Thankfully, I only have one, like, or actually two sit down tests. One's this week, and then the other one's actually next week. Um, today's Sunday, obviously. But, and then I just have like a ton of like group projects and presentations. I'm really thankful they're not all final exams where you have to sit and like study and like the whole nine hours. It's more of like actually applying what you learned and putting it into um, your project, which I personally enjoy a lot more. I'm sure a lot of you guys could agree. Um, so yeah, I've got a to-do list here of all the things I want to get done today. I have a blog assignment for my trend forecasting class. I have an optional extra credit paper that I can do for my textiles testing class that I want to do. Um, I have a multi-channel marketing assignment thing where I have to like make a website with that's a group project. I have to do a peer rating review thing. And then I want to start studying for my trend forecasting exam that is later this week. So yeah, I feel pretty prepared. I feel pretty good about it, but um, I just want to go somewhere and do this because I just simply can't always focus in my own apartment. So I think I'm going to go to Panera Bread. Um, I think that's what we're doing. I have a friend that also has a lot of work to get done, so she's going to join. Um, here's my little outfit. I'm putting this on. It's a little chilly outside. I just love an excuse to go to Panera too because I haven't been to Panera in so long. I really think I'm going to get chicken noodle soup in a bread bowl. Maybe not in a bread bowl. Haven't decided yet. Putting on my shoes. I definitely want chicken noodle soup. I love their mac and cheese, but soup just sounds actually amazing. I wonder if they have iced coffee there. I don't know. Um, also, I wanted to update you guys. Um, I think I am going to do it to my hair. If you guys watched yesterday's, or I guess two days ago now, um, I was talking about doing a root smudge to so like darker up here. Keeping this, like not touching this at all, and then like two blonde money pieces. And pretty much everyone except for like one person said I should do it. I don't know, I just think it'll be a fun change if I really hate it. I feel like I can go back to blonde. Sorry, I know my hair just looks weird like this, but I just like to have my hair behind my ears. I think we've got everything here. I'll show you guys my outfit before we head out the door. All right, here is the fit for the day. This is like my new favorite tank top. It's from Revolve. If it's still on the website, I will link it down below because it's so comfortable and it's just really flattering. I like the shape, random chain necklace. This I actually got, it's in my most recent try on haul. You guys should definitely go check it out. Um, it's this shacket from Abercrombie and Fitch actually, but I love like the brown color. It's nice when it's like it's 52, so I don't need like a heavy, heavy jacket. Earrings are from 60 stacks. I'm wearing these leggings that are from Pure Velo. They're from one of their sets. They're so comfortable, kind of shiny, which I like. And then my Air Force Ones, and I'm just bringing along this bag. We're gonna go. I also just wanted to say I have amazing news. We are 100% going to be restocking my planner. We're doing well daily, like just found out. I'm so excited. They are gonna go on sale before Christmas, so get hype. Sign up for doing well daily's like email notifications so you definitely are aware. And also follow me and her on Instagram at Danielle Carolyn at doing well daily so you can be the first to know. I can't believe the planner sold out in an hour. I could not have expected that, but you guys are amazing. So don't worry, we are doing a restock because so many more people want them i'm so excited and wow this all got out at my red light this is awesome okay that's all that's all all right we got a chicken noodle soup and i got extra bread because this stuff is so good all right we just ate now it's time to grind <laughs> Decided to go for some hot coffee, need a little extra energy. I've never tried Panera, so updates to come. Okay, ready? The best part ever. Shake it. <laughs> it's not wearing spinach. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, that's so satisfying. All right, we just left Panera, or I'm in my car now. Shout out for today's small business, Shop No Cap on Instagram. They have the cutest masks, and this one's super thick, which I really like. Woo, I got so much done, sorry. I'm like, you know when you're like focusing on work for so long that you kind of forget how to socialize? It's kind of how I am right now. Um, I'm so happy I got so much done, and the sun's not down yet, which is hype, because the sun sets so early here, but I have zero groceries. I've managed to get by about a week without going grocery shopping really at all. So we're gonna go to Kroger. I wanted to go to Trader Joe's, but I really wanna make chili this week because I made it once and it was so good. And the recipe I use, I need specific chili beans um, that they only sell at Kroger. So we're gonna go there and then I'm gonna also get more kombucha because I'm 
This sounds so good. Some fruit, and I think I'm gonna do some sort of like chicken and broccoli or zucchini dish this week. Just kind of like planning out my meals. I like making extra too, so that I have leftovers for lunch. Because I don't like to make lunch. I like to have leftovers for lunch because I feel like making lunch is just takes so much time out of the day. But yeah, so we're gonna head to the Krogs and then go back. I wanted to wash my comforter too. I like to do that every now and then. I have not in a while. I wash my sheets a lot, but not my comforter. Um, and I was also just planned our gals on the go podcast episode this week that's actually with audrey challenger and i'm so excited i found her on tiktok like a while back and now she has a youtube channel and she kills it so i was like planning out our interview questions for that because i am so excited to record with her tomorrow so that's that might go to the christmas market that i was talking about tonight um it's like this outdoor christmas market they have like hot chocolate and like a little christmas tree thing and i don't know it just looks really cute and festive and any excuse to be festive I'm here for. We're gonna go to Kroger. I'll do a little grocery haul when I'm back. I'll see you guys soon. All right, let's do the dang thing. All right, we're back. Got a kombucha for the road too. <laughs> this is the best invention ever. I've got my school bag there. I've got all my groceries. We'll take it up to the apartment. I mean, you all need one of these. I literally just looked up like grocery cart on Amazon. Go get you one. All right, here you have it. A little grocery haul. Watermelon's like my favorite food ever. So we have got a big thing of watermelon. I got I always get four kombuchas. This is my favorite flavor, gingerberry. I'm drinking that one right now. Recently discovered I really enjoy this snack. I'm not a big snacker, but pretzel chips are delicious. Got a thing of black beans because one of my meals this week is probably gonna be yellow rice, black beans, and green beans. Got two of these Annie's mac and cheese little cups just for quick little. Okay, they're good. Um, then a lot of this stuff is for the chili. I'm doubling the recipe and I literally just used the recipe on the back of this Bush's chili beans um, recipe. It's the one that my mom's always used and I love it. All right, um, we've got ketchup because that's part of the recipe. Onions and um, garlic, butter, or yeah, this is butter, buttery spread, whatever. Love this stuff. Zucchini and chicken. I'm gonna make a meal with that or I'm gonna add broccoli or like do broccoli and zucchini. So yeah, I'll do some sort of chicken and broccoli and zucchini situation or make that separate, I don't really know, but I wanted to have both options. The ground beef is for the chili, I got more eggs. Celery is also for the chili, but I also really enjoy celery as a snack. And then I got bananas, so I think I covered it all. That's my little grocery haul, and I'm actually gonna probably get started on this chili. guys the chili is finally done it's such a satisfying thing to make because you're basically just throwing a ton of things in a big old pot and it simmers for about 30 40 minutes depending on I doubled the recipe because I want to have a ton um, for the week so I'm gonna pop the lid on here and I've got the um, timer on for 30 minutes. I have lots of cleaning to do now. All right, you guys, the chili is almost ready. I just poured the rest of my kombucha in this beautiful wine glass that my friend Katie Bellotti designed. She hand wrote that. Why not? It's not wine, but it's okay. Um, I am deciding that I have a bad, uh, I have bad luck with this holiday market, this Christmas market, market in Athens. I was gonna go tonight. It closed at six. It is 6.30, so. Wasn't meant to go this year, sadly. Um, so yeah, I actually ended up inviting Ryan over for dinner tonight because anytime I can cook for him, I feel really cool because I don't like cook a lot, a lot. Um, and I know he loves chili. And this chili is so freaking good and I made extras and the timer's about to go off and say it's done. Um, so yeah, I think he's actually almost here. So I'm gonna go down and grab him. Um, I guess we'll just like watch a movie. Maybe I'll convince him to watch a Christmas movie eat the good old chili. All right, Ryan's here now, and I had a feeling <laughs> I wouldn't be able to convince him to watch a Christmas movie. He goes straight to the poster and goes, what should we watch tonight? So the difference between Ryan and I is I like rom-coms, fun. I can like appreciate a good movie, but he wants to watch usually one of these like top 100 movies, and we still have to cross off a lot. If you guys didn't know, we got this on Amazon. 
And the ones that we've... Do you know they have one of these for TV shows too? Really? Yeah. Oh. I'm sure they have a lot of different kinds. Santa hat never fails. <laughs> Chili almost done. Dinner is served. You're good. <laughs> He's like, can I eat? <laughs> All right, you guys, got lots of leftovers. So happy now. We're trying to figure out what movie to watch. All right, that is it for Vlogmas Day 6. Ooh. We're literally watching every movie trailer <laughs> ever. That is one flaw of mine. I'm very particular with the movies I watch. Yeah. I mean, you don't like to watch my movies either. Oh, I know. We, we have different <laughs> We just don't. Parts. Yeah, it's hard to find that, like... Whatever. So comment down below some of your favorite movies to watch with your boyfriend that you both like. Well, yeah, we need some new ideas. We need some new ideas. Also, shout out Ryan for yesterday's video. Everyone seemed to really like Thanks. it. They like you, Ryan. They Appreciate improve. It. The damn fam approves. Well, I like them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. I'm ending today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe so you're notified every time I post a new video. And I'll see you guys soon. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. See ya.